What's up out there, Internet Land? Jackie B, Captain Jack, Facebook, Family, Friends, YouTube, Periscope, Twitter. I want to cut this video today to continue on with my series about the nine reasons, the nine reasons why retirement or financial independence is becoming extinct. We talked about number nine is ignorance. Not that people are stupid, but they're ignorant about the facts. We talked about number eight was poor calculations or bad assumptions. Talked about number seven is despair. Talked about number six is the luck, the, the casino mindset. Talked about number five being the gig economy. There's nobody that really sticks with anybody for any extended period of time. They go from one gig to the other. Talked about number four, which is attitude adjustment. And today, number three is a failure to communicate. A failure to communicate, you know. It's been said that it's not necessarily what you say, but how you say it. And I'm here to tell you that I think it's not only what you say, but also how you say it. And as it relates around people's wealth or finances, there's not a lot of communication done. You know, in fact, uh, a lack of communication is probably, you know, not surprised because most people don't even talk about their savings anyway. 54% of respondents say that the only person they feel comfortable even discussing their current retirement savings with is their spouse or partner. Only 36% would discuss the subject with family, and only 22% would talk about it with friends about it. It's kind of scary. If there are really are friends and family and stuff, why aren't we talking about this? Is it the elephant in the room? Is it that people just don't want to talk about this dinosaur that's going to become extinct because of all the reasons I've mentioned before. As for co-workers, just 6% would talk about their retirement savings with colleagues. Although more communication on the topic, no doubt, could be could provide an education on both sides of the discussion because, quite frankly, people are just, you know, walking through life kind of winging it. And I think that's why this is becoming extinct, you know. And I want to give you an example about a failure to communicate. Recently, in the last couple months, a, a friend of mine had asked me to invest in a business. He had asked me to invest in a business. And although he had a lot of passion and concern and, and energy, the, the communication was very vague and there was a lot of holes left out there. Well, I had some questions around this particular business investment. And once I started asking pertinent questions, pushback came to me about how dare I, how dare I. And here he was asking me to invest in the business, yet asked me how dare I. And it was really around just a, a simple concept of a startup business taking large salaries. I've never known a startup company to have somebody take large salaries. It's all based on what the profitability of the enterprise would look like. and. So, you know, I was excited to work with this individual, but the lack of communication, the failure to communicate when there were questions asked really is what hindered it. So I think, you know, the message today is a lack of communication. There's all kinds of marketing coming from Madison Avenue, coming from Wall Street, coming from all the institutions that want to just continue to control your wealth and your money. And if you want to make 2017 the best year ever by educating yourself around this topic, if you want to work your whole life, hey, that's your business. If not, that's my business. So reach out to me, private message me or inbox me, and we can talk more about some particulars in your world. Again, I hope you're enjoying this series. My name is Jackie B. Captain Jack, located outside of, Co outside of uh, New Orleans in a suburb called Covington. And I hope you make it an awesome day out there, and I'll see you on the next video.